The Georgia Bulldogs are one of the most successful programs in college football, winning back-to-back yes, -back national yes, championships. But last year, they failed to make the college football playoff. The Georgia Bulldogs are not SEC champions, suffering their first loss in, well, a while. <clears throat> Our goal is to win Georgia a national championship. And if I don't complete that, along with the rest of these goals, one of you guys will be wearing a brand new jersey. Let's begin. Georgia, number one team in the country, five-star, 91 overall, 335 defense in a pro-style offense. Let's take a look at the roster. Obviously, the headliner, senior Carson, back to court. Quarterback. His number one target is going to be Oscar Delp, the man replacing Brock Bowers. Got a great offensive line, obviously led by senior Tate Ratledge and junior Dylan Fairchild. And then defensively weapons everywhere. Nazir Stackhouse on the D-line, Smale Mondin and Michael Williams at linebacker, and then Malachi Starks in the secondary. Obviously a decent amount of these guys could come back, but not all seniors, but I'm anticipating every one of them leaving. At quarterback for the future, we do have Gunnar Stock. We should be good here for the entirety of the rebuild. Obviously we have Oscar Delp, but we do have Ben Urisic. He is a senior, so we're going to be losing both of them. Tight end's probably a position I recruit because I don't know how I feel about Lawson Lucky or even Jaden Riddell, Todd Bass. <laughs> They don't like Will Snelling. At left guard, Dylan Fairchild's gone. We do have Micah Morris. We're going to be fine in the trenches. At right guard, maybe we have to go after someone because Kelton Smith, he's only a freshman. We'll see how he does. At D tackle, we do have Nazir Stackhouse. He's the leader, but we do have Jamal Jarrett. He's a guy that I think can develop. We also have Xavier McLeod and Amadi Boko. I mean, we should be fine at D tackle. And at linebacker, Samuel Mapemba, he's an absolute stud. We also have Damon Wilson. We're going to be fine here. Same at Mike. We have CJ Allen. We have Raylan Wilson. I'm even redshirting Justin Williams, but he's a stud. And then at free safety, we have Yono Aguero. We also have KJ Bolden. He's another guy. I'm red shirting. All right, let's take a look at the recruiting board. Dion Harper, the number one quarterback in the country, the number one player in the country. I know we have Carson back and Gunnar Stockton, but also have Keyshawn Morrison, athlete Daquan Allers, defensive tackle Miles Guy, another guy that can come in and replace Nazir Stackhouse. Same with Jamie Boone. Strong safety Del Ivy, right end Cliff Fitzsimmons, right end Manny Trejo, cornerback Robbie Henningsen, and left tackle Abdul Flowers. I mean, we're Georgia. We have the, the ability to go after five star talent. All right, well, we got our first commit of the video, JD Costonzo. He is a bust, but we're just looking for depth at right guard. And we get another commit. I know, again, another busted Jeff. But Manu Vitali at corner. Start the season off in the AFAC kickoff game against number 17 Clemson. This is supposed to be Tennessee Tech. That should be an easy win. We go to Kentucky. We have our first bye. Number six Alabama. We host Auburn. Host Mississippi State. Go to number three Texas. Have our second bye. Then go to Florida. Go to number five Ole Miss. Host number 15 S Tennessee to end SEC play. And our final two games of the season against UMass and against Georgia Tech. We add BJ Williams, the free safety to our board. Someone that could come in to replace Malachi Starks. Help provide depth in the secondary. First game of the season. This is the AFLAC kickoff, the game of the week. We're going to take on number 17 Clemson. I'm going to hop into this one. Clemson moving the ball. We got to get a stop here. Got to send some pressure. I'm sitting on Malachi Starks. Fly over there. Fly over there. Oh, got to make a play. No, no way. No. Oh, that was a bad pursuit ankle. Dude, there's no way Troy Stilato just third down and 10. Got to make a play here. I'm looking for Oscar Delp across the middle. Hold on to it, Oscar. Oh, Oscar Delp. You got to hold on to that ball, big fella. Oh, something's Yep, I knew it. I knew it. Who is... Dude, we're in man coverage, bro. How is he so wide open? All right, we got to get something. Our offense has to get going. I think, the, I think the blitz is coming from that mic. I like Humphreys up the seam if they're in man. Lead him. Lead him! Nice ball! Carson back! Upfield! Let's go! And we get the ball back. If we can tie the game before half, that would be huge. Oh, I did not mean to throw that ball. I didn't, I didn't mean to... Son of a bitch, dude. Where, how do they? Wow, I did not think that ball was gonna get through. Putting Humphreys on it just a designated out. Yep, left the corner wide open, coming down. Here we go, let's see if we can get in with a jet touch pass. They're in zone, this is perfect. Give me that block. Give me that block. There we go! We cut it to a one score game. I'm gonna bring Dan Jackson down, cover the running back manually, I'm bringing some heat. Give me there, no! Okay, I knocked him out of bounds. Oh my God. Defensively, bro, we can't stop this Clemson offense. I made one bad read, I did. I made a mistake there, we gotta get a stop here. Oh, it's play action. Oh, yep. Give me that! He threw it right at me! That was where my that was where my user was supposed to be, but the DB Dan, or let's see how they cover this. They don't cover it at all. Let's go! The motion in the wheel route! Let's go! Take the check down, huge. And there's an incompletion. I want to see if I can bring pressure here. I don't want Kate Klubnik to have time. Give me that! Oh no, you just gotta take that eight. Oh my god. I don't know who that is. You gotta go get that ball. Here we go. But hit one of these crossers. I think that's yeah, the read. That's the read. Just take my check down. I just need a field goal. I don't have to score a touchdown. I hate the fact that the damn scoreboard goes away. But if they're just gonna sit back in too high, I'm just gonna attack. Take everything across the middle. Like that. That's wide open. Like I'm in field goal range already. Oh, bro. That's game. Now I just run the clock out. Oh my God, we actually made a great comeback. 
right there. Nice job by the offensive line. We scored a touchdown just over a minute to go. And the Georgia Bulldogs are going to come back and take down Clemson. This is a huge win for us. Clemson is a rival of Georgia, so we're now 1-0 and versus our rivals. We're going to start scheduling visits. We have Jamie Boone coming to our game against Auburn. He'll be a huge gift for us. We're also going to switch him to a hard sell. We don't know his third interest, but I think we can determine that it's a championship contender based on just what we know. So I'm going to take a shot with this one. Next up, we got a game against Tennessee Tech. We're going to send this one. Take a look at the game against Tennessee Tech. Carson Beck played fantastic. Oscar Delp had 80 yards. Lennon Humphrey, 76 with a touchdown. Dylan Bell, 40 yards with a touchdown. And then defensively, Malachi Starks with a pick. Only had one sack from Nazir Stackhouse. I'm kind of surprised, but played well. Doesn't really matter. Next up, we got number 23, Kentucky. This is our first true road game. We're going to hop into this one. I think this is an important game. Third and seven. Kroger Field is rocking. We need this first down here. No, bad ball by me. Oh, you're nice job. Spin move. Oh my God, Whoo! what a play. London Humphrey is a fantastic play. The offense is marching now. They're gonna bring a blitz here. I'm gonna put Bell on a drag underneath. Here we go. That's PI, first of all, but okay. Bringing some big pressure here. I like this double drag. Put my drag, don't come down on it. He did, but we still caught it. Nice catch by Oscar Dell. I thought they were gonna sink deeper into the zones, but Bell on an out, this is a touchdown. Let's smart route you, yeah. No! Oh my god, they flew out there. Okay. All right, we're going to take our three. Third and five. I'm sitting on Mond and we've got to get a stop here. Do they run this ball? They do. No, it's play action. No, it's not. Oh my god. Fourth and inches. Oh, do they go for it? They do not. First and goal. Let's put the ball in the hands of Travis Etienne here. Trevor, I don't remember which one it is. I'm sorry. Bad with names. There we go, though. Huge five yard run. Trevor Etienne, my bad. Bringing some pressure here. I think Oscar Delp might be open. Let's see if this motion from London Humphreys. Oh, they're in man. No, they're in zone. They're... Touchdown. We take a 10-point lead in Kentucky. Kentucky answers back. We're at the two-minute warning. We're only up three. They're bringing a blitz on that right side of the field. Hit my crosser. Get up field. Oscar Delp. Nice job. Bringing pressure off that left side. Which means these crossers. I got to let them. I got four yards, but I got to let that develop a little more. Get ice ball, Carson Beck. Spin move. Oh my God, that was a nasty play. Carson Beck got hit as he threw, but nice job. I think if this, if I have time for this route to develop, yeah, I'm just gonna take off. Take off. Take Stupid. off! No, no! I didn't need to do that. I didn't need to do all that. Our defense got us the ball right back. That's huge. Stadium's kind of rocking here. I think put Humphreys on a post. And I think that clears for Levette. Yep. Go get it, 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 go get it! We absolutely rolled Kentucky. We get another commit in halfback Isaac Cronk. This is huge. Four-star right tackle Reggie Treadwell. Five-star cornerback Robbie Henningsen. Five-star defensive tackle. Five-star defensive tackle Jamie Boone. This is a guy that can replace him. This is your stack house. Looking at the injury report, Ra Ra Thomas has the dislocated hip. He's out for a month. We're going to be fine at receiver, at least for now. We have Dominic Levette. We have Dylan Bell. We have Colby Young. We still have London Humphreys. And Arian Smith and a pinch will be fine. A little late to the game, but we're going to add free safety Tim Casey to our board. Someone that I think could come in and help replace the loss of Malachi Starks. Also going to add quarterback Bill Feeney. Just want to get as much talent in the quarterback position as we can. This is going to be our toughest test yet. We have to go to Alabama. This is probably the game of the year. Third and four. We're driving. They're going to bring some pressure off that left side. Hopefully the line holds up. Please. Oh, I got to lead him more. I let him up field. A 46-yard field goal at Bryant Denny. Nailed it. Oh, wait, we take a 3 nothing lead. We strike first. Huge third down here. I got to get a stop. I'm going to sit on Mondin. I'm going to come. Oh, nope. It's a pass. Cross the middle. Oh, give me that. Get out of there. Get out of there, Dan Jackson. Got to outrun Jalen Milrow. Does he have the speed? Oh, he doesn't. But we're in the red zone. Huge play by Dan Jackson. If we can get a touchdown out of this, that would be huge. Oh, huge, huge, huge. I'm taking off. This is a touchdown. This is a touchdown. Let's go. We take a 10-0 lead. Alabama will not be denied. I got to bring some pressure. Third and 12. I cannot let Jalen Milrow sit back there. I'm on Aguero. Get there. Huge sack. Let's go fourth and 25. There's no way they kick a field goal now. Alabama actually takes the lead. It didn't matter. We're going to try running the ball. Nice job by the line. Nice job by the line. Go get him. Go get him. Nice job, ETN. Oh, that's Robert Robinson. That wasn't even ETN. Never mind. That was a backup running back. Cross his face. No, no, no. I didn't think the linebacker. First and 10, they're in the red zone. I got to dial it up. Here we go. Get there. Get there. Get there. Get there. No, yes. Huge sack. Three sacks in the first half. We're playing great on defense. Third and 19. I'm actually going to call a timeout. I think I can get this ball back. If they kick a field goal, they kick a field goal. That's fine. I'm on Harris here. No, no, no. Okay, fine. We'll get their field goal. We'll have 30 seconds. If we can get something out of it, that'd be awesome. Bust out a screen here. I haven't tried it yet. Let's see how this looks. Throwing Robinson to the wide side. They don't even cover it. Okay, fine. Let's go. Let's take off. 
There we go. Give me a couple. We got six. Gonna call another motion play. I want to see if they're in man here. If they are, I like these crossers. They're in something. Let's see where they go. <sighs> Hit the cross. Stay. Come back. Come back. Get a field. Cut up field. Let's go. We tie the game. Gonna bring some major pressure. Third down. If we can get a stop here, that would be huge. I'm sitting on Aguero over top. Get there. Oh, he throws it away. Let's go. We're gonna get the ball back. All right, here we go. There. Yep, that's my check. Clear. Come back. Let's go! Let's go! We take a touchdown lead. Up by seven. I'm bringing some heat. Gotta get a stop here. Empty backfield. I'm sitting over top. Come back, come back, come back. Dan Jackson. Oh my god. Yeah, I was in man. That's my fault. I'm gonna keep sitting in man. We have the personnel to cover them. I'm, I'm gonna bring Pope down, cover underneath. I'm gonna switch it up, go zone here. I'm gonna sit on Mond in here. Anything across the middle is mine. Empty backfield. Oh, it's a design run. Oh my God, he just broke it. What? Dude, no way. No way. A field goal wins the game. I'm gonna try to not give them the ball back. The stadium pulse is fucking up my, I don't know what the play call is. Dude, come back. Stadium pulse is messing everything up. I'm glad I know Humphrey's route because that's the one I'm looking at. A is Delp across the middle. Break. Go get the ball. Go get the ball. Go get the ball. This stadium pulse, I don't even remember who's where. This is not gonna be fun. I love the motion though, they're in man. Play action, step up, get my check down, either in man, this should be free. Give me that block. Stay on your feet, ETN! No! Oh, he fell out of bounds, okay. Woo, woo, woo. They're in, they are in man. I'm just gonna hit this underneath. I just need a field goal. So I'm gonna take this to the two minute warning. Now we'll see if we can run this clock out and win this game on the road. This would be an incredible win. Stay on your feet, stay on your feet, ETN! Second and five of first down seals the game. Pressing it, gives it. All right, here we go give it no 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 it was the other way dude ea and their stupid ass read option switch oh my god okay i drilled it so we're going to be up three we just need one more stop from the defense they don't need a touchdown they just need a field goal so no point in trying to do this huge sack by christian miller great job by our three-man rush now i'm bringing pressure third and 16 great job by our three-man rush Fourth and 16, if I don't get this, the game is over. I'm gonna sit on Mondin. I guess I'm on a D-lineman. Give me that, no, it doesn't matter. Game over, Georgia comes into Tuscaloosa and knocks off the Alabama Crimson Tide. Wow, we had a great third quarter. That was the difference. We get five-star right end, Manny Trejo. This is huge. Five-star strong safety, Del Ivy, just continuing to add talent to this class. Dan Jackson with a huge pick and four tackles. He is the SEC Defense Player of the Week. I lied, he actually, I lied. He had seven sacks, a tackle, and a pick. A huge game from Dan Jackson. A Dan dead nation, some would say. I know it's pretty late, but we're gonna add five-star right outside linebacker Andy Parker to the board. I think we can get him. He'd be a huge contributor for us. We're also gonna add two more guys to our board in athlete Philip Russo and five-star right end Alex Cobbs. We get another right end in five-star Cliff Fitzsimmons. Took him out of Green Bay. What a weird place to come from. We won the game against Auburn. I assumed this one, a game against our rivals, which means we moved to 2-0 against our rivals. Found another five-star guy that wasn't really getting recruited. Broderick Yates, the five-star free safety. Again, just trying to get guys that we can put in secondary he can might be able to replace Malachi Starks we're gonna go after him pretty heavily taking on Mississippi State this week I'm gonna send this one get another five-star D lineman in Miles Guy and even though we absolutely annihilated Mississippi State Andy Park decides to commit to Florida so we're gonna take him off our board we've played in a lot of games so far but this game against Texas might be our most important yet all right here we go DKR Memorial Stadium is absolutely rocking this is not gonna be an easy game to win hit my check down hold on I'm gonna try read option here <sighs> I did the wrong thing. I needed to hold that there. Dude, I just can't remember. The fact that they switched read option, and you know what's even worse is it's not the same in this game as it is in Madden. So it's like, I have to remember two different ones. Oh my God, how does he not, how does my punter never get drilled? And I don't mean that, whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't even know who that was, bro. He put me on some skates. Gotta get a stop here. This is gonna be a huge, I gotta bring some pressure. I'm gonna go sit on Wilson over the middle. Big hit. Damn. We got to be able to hold them to three here. Get out there. Nice job. Hold them to the field goal. See if we can hit one of these. Oh, they're bringing some mage. Oh, no. Bad ball. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, my God. If that dude left his flat, that was an easy pick. He'll have the lead. Our defense is playing fantastic right now. Bringing pressure off that edge. Set my check down. Spin move back. Oh, my God. He was sitting on it. First and 10. We got to hold them to the field goal. I'm bringing some pressure. Oh, I'm stuck on a D lineman. It's an RPO. No, I knew it. I was trying to get over there. I got stuck on a D lineman. We're up by five. We got to get a stop here. Sitting on Dan Jackson. Coming down. No. Nope. Yes. Yes. Nice job. Third and six. I'm going to dial up some pressure here. I'm sitting in man. I'm going to sit on. Oh my God. I got stuck on a D lineman. 
Dude, I got stuck. Oh my god. Dude, how can I D lineman again? Is this a run? This might be a run. It is. I'm coming down fast. No, get there! Get there! Let's go! Dude. I didn't. Uh, I'm making such bad reads right now. Dude, oh my god, my offensive line. Defense, I need one more stop out of you, man. They run this ball. They are, there's a run. No, it's not. Huge sack, oh my god. We have the third sack of the day. Excellent job by our D-line. Third and 16, I trust in our defense. I'm gonna bring some pressure. I'm sitting on the spy with Mondin. Oh my god, great defense. I'm gonna switch up the coverage. I'm gonna sit back this time. I got Mondin. get there huge nice job by our defense we got the fumble and that's gonna do it boys we're in field goal range <sighs> touch no no come back oh my god i thought it was a crossing route oh my god oscar dell we take down texas we come into austin and take down texas we get five star free safety bj williams this could be the malachi starks replacement taking a look at the injury report in our final bye this season dylan fairchild has a dislocated hip he's out for two months theoretically that puts him out for the rest of the regular season who knows if he'll be back for the playoff we do have left guard micah morris who's going to start there so we're actually going to move tate ratledge to left guard he's the senior starting right guard we're gonna move him there i feel comfortable starting him there um do have kelton smith here he's going to start at right guard want to develop him for me honest Bo Hewley the right tackle and then Micah Morris I mean we're thin it off at the line we really gotta hope we don't have any more injuries I know it's super late in the season but we're actually gonna add five-star wide receiver Mafu Kohu to our board he's someone that just became available we get five-star free safety Tim Casey another guy that come in the secondary again might be the Malachi Starks replacement who knows got a lot of competition there taking a look at the first top 25 Miami then there's us obviously Texas LSU surprise South Carolina here at 12 we tried to get on a Mafu Kohu but he locked us out so we're gonna take him off the board next up we're taking on Florida this is a huge Huge rivalry game. If we can win this, we go to 3 0 against our rivals. I like Delp on this route, depending on how they. Oh, they. Oh, no, no, no! Dude, I, I hit the wrong button. I actually hit the wrong fucking button. I hit the wrong button. He was naked. Dude, get this fucking gator chomp out of my face, bro. Oh my god. Shout out to the defense putting in some work, putting Delp on a drag. I think they bring pressure on that left side. Dude, what the fuck is happening, bro? There, this. Dude, I've had the ball for two plays. I've thrown a pick and fumbled it. I hope Carson Beck wasn't a Heisman finalist because he damn sure ain't one right now. Hold on to it. Stay on your feet. Get over him. Let's go. Oh my God, what a catch and run. Gotta get a stop here at midfield. Third down, bring in some heat. I'm gonna go sit on Malachi Starks. Bro, I keep forgetting Graham Mertz is this quarterback. <sighs> oh, good job. Oh my God, I'm about to say there's no way he just cooked us. Cut inside. There we go. We would have like three touchdowns right now. We're gonna get a nice run here. Yep, get out. Get out of there, Trevor Etienne! Huge run, we take a two touchdown lead. After that, it was an absolute annihilation. Dylan Bell against Florida, 93 receiving yards, two touchdowns, also had 30 yards on the ground with another rushing touchdown. He had a great game. Even though we annihilated Florida, Deion Harper decides to commit to Wisconsin, so we're gonna take him off our board. Next up, we gotta go to Ole Miss. I hopped into a lot of games, we're gonna let that computer handle this one. We get another five-star free safety in Broderick Yates. Just can't have too much talent. Next up, we have another rivalry game against Tennessee. Hopefully we can win this one. We get a five-star quarterback in Bill Feeney. This could be the Carson Beck replacement. And we get another five-star defensive end in Alex Cobbs. And even though we beat Tennessee, five-star quarterback Keyshawn Morrison decides to commit to Ohio State, so we're going to take him off our board. Next up, we got UMass. We should have no problem with the Minutemen. We're going to use our coach points to increase recruiting for offensive linemen. That's huge. Our final game of the season against Georgia Tech, another rivalry game. Right now, we're 4-0. If we win this, we'll be 5-0 against our rivals. We get a five-star center in Philip Rousseau, and we're taking on Florida. Before the SEC championship game, I want to look at some injuries. Obviously, we do still have Dylan Fairchild out a couple weeks. If we make it the playoffs and we make it far, he's probably going to be able to come back. Yanel Aguero has a torn labrum. He's out for three weeks. That's going to be interesting. Obviously, we still have Malachi Starks. Ja'Cory Thomas can fill in for him and then Bucky Phillips. So we're fine at free safety. We are taking on Florida in the SEC Championship game. I popped into a lot of games and I've already played Florida. I'm going to let the CPU handle this. Just like that, 13-0, the SEC champion. We are now the number one overall seed. I win the coach of the year. That's awesome. We'd love to see that. We win the Broyles Award. Our offensive coordinator wins the best coordinator in the country. Petteroa McNeil.
McMillan wins the Heisman. That's the first time I've seen that. Tate Ratledge wins best interior offensive lineman. Jared Wilson wins best center, played all 13 games. Michael Williams, 11 sacks, almost a sack a game, 49 tackles, and a forced fumble. Did we have a Heisman finalist? We did. Carson Beck was a Heisman finalist. Okay, so that means we complete that goal. And we won the SEC title. So we have completed right now, technically, two of our goals. We don't have any off the field incidents right now. We have a winning record versus our rivals. We just need to get a top 10 recruiting class and win a national championship. And I'll have completed every goal I set. Taking a look at the award winners, obviously, Carson Beck in the running for Heisman. I win head coach of the year. He was also in the running for the best quarterback. Michael Williams was second for best defensive player. Damn. Best DB, we had three in the running, and Dalen Everett, Dan Jackson, and Malachi Starks, but we couldn't win. That's crazy. Best running back, Trevor Etienne. I know I personally didn't showcase him as much, but our team in the sim leaned on him heavily. Carson Beck, third for the Johnny Unitas Award. Best interior offensive lineman. We had legitimately six guys. You only start five offensive linemen, we had six on this. Oscar Delp, second for best tight end. Michael Williams for best linebacker, but not to overshadow Smell Mondin. Best center, Jared Wilson. Also want to give a shout out to Drew Bobo. Brett Thorson, third for the best punter. And Dominic Levette, fourth for best returner. We had an absolutely incredible season. Let's take a look at early national signing day. Got Miles Guy. We got Jamie Boone. Both these guys could replace from the Zier Stackhouse. We bring in Dell Ivey. We bring in BJ Williams and Tim Casey. These could be the Malachi Starks replacements. We bring in Bill Feeney, the Carson Beck replacement. We go get Cliff Fitzsimmons, Manny Trejo, Philip Rousseau, Alex Cobbs, Robbie Henningsen, and Broder Gates, another guy that could replace Malachi Starks. We brought in an absolutely loaded class. Okay, so we're obviously the one seed. Miami sneaks by UNLV. Wisconsin sneaks by Arizona. Oregon kills Kentucky. Kansas State smacks South Carolina. So the top eight seeds all advance. Michigan has to take on Miami. We have to take on Wisconsin. This is a great playoff. But now we take on Wisconsin in the quarterfinal. The Sugar Bowl in New Orleans at the Caesars Superdome. Looks like they're going to bring some pressure here. I'm going to put, put Bell on a drag. They are. They're bringing some big pressure. Hit my go, 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 go. Oh, a nice first play. The wheel route might be out. Oh, it is. Darren man. Oh, they got a linebacker on ETN. They got a linebacker on ETN. What are you doing? I think they're bringing a big blitz. They are. Nice catch, Oscar Dell. I can't shed the block. Damn. Wisconsin's got a good running attack. I'm sitting on mine then again across the middle. Oh my God, I couldn't. Oh, I switched on to the wrong guy. I thought I was going to switch on to that safety. They're running all over us. I got to bring some pressure. Third and inches. I got to bring some pressure here. Sit on Walker. Oh. No, don't push him in. What are we doing? Oh my God. They're offensively, we've been fine, but it's the defense that needs help right now. I'm gonna sit on Malachi Starks. There we go. Great job, defense. I'm gonna bring a big blitz. I'm gonna fly back with Dan Jackson. Williams is gonna have to get there. But huge sack. All right, so we have a four point lead. We're gonna have a chance to score before the half. That'd be awesome. I'm gonna put Lovett on an out. I think that would, oh no. He's wide open. I didn't think they were going to leave him like that. Get out of bounds. I thought he was going to flat. How are they guarding? Oh, they're not. Bro, what are we doing? I meant to spin. Second inch is okay. We're moving. I think this is cover four, not cover two. Yes, this is. They're leaving everything underneath. I don't know why they're just in prevent. This is ridiculous. I'm going to walk down the field if they just sit in this defense. They're in too high. I'm going to put Delp on a post and Thomas on a corner. Delp is my read. Got it. Touchdown. Nice job. Let's go. I'll be honest, guys. I thought this game was going to be a lot closer. We whooped Wisconsin. Carson Beck, 303 or three touchdowns. Beautiful game. Take a look at the bracket. We obviously won Miami upsets Michigan. Oregon upsets Clemson and Kansas State upsets Utah. So we're the only team to not get upset. We got Miami, Oregon versus Kansas State, and the winners play each other in the national championship game. Side of the uniforms a little bit. Let's go with the black uniforms. This is the semifinals, baby. We got to bring our A game. Going to bring some pressure. We need to stop here against Miami. Sitting on Harris. Coming down. Oh, he's taking the top off. No. No! And the hurricane strike first. That is not good. I'm taking off a of Carson back. I'm taking off a of Carson back. Oh, I tried to slide. It didn't even let me slide. I got a first down. Get out of there. Get out of there. Let's go. Wow. Okay. I guess that was a great play call. Nice job by me. Block shed. Get out of there. I'm bringing pressure. I don't want Cam Ward to get comfortable. I'm sitting on Malachi Starks over the top. Nothing. <sighs> Give me that. Oh my god, I'm taking this back too. I probably should have just not done that, but... Spin move! Oh! Get up field. Get up field! Dominic Levet! You cannot catch him! Oh my goodness! I think this is going to be wide open. Yep. Right across the middle. Spin move. Third man again. Back across his face. Pause. Get up field! I'm going to call my final timeout. I'm going to put Delp on and out. Hold on to it. Let's go. Let's see what they do here. Do they recognize it's a blitz? Oh, it's a fake. 
Nice job by the defense. I'm just gonna keep bringing pressure. They haven't shown that they can stop it. I'm sitting on Walker. He's got the halfback. He's got DJ Martinez. Or D Damian Martinez, my bad. I fucked his name up, but... We played great defense in the red zone. Nice job, Nazir Stackhouse, getting back there. We gotta get a stop here, boys. At least hold him to a field goal. I'm sitting on Malachi Stark. I'm flying down. There we go. Third and two. Bringing pressure again. This time I'm gonna bring Harris down. Oh, bad. There we go. Fourth and two. We held him. What the? Wait, 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 wait. Get there. Yes, we stopped it. They went for a fake field goal. I've never seen that before. Got Jones going to one side, Bell going to the other. They're in, man. Touchdown. Let's go! Fourth and one, I'm bringing pressure. Or, dude. I thought I got stuck on a D-lineman. So I sent him straight forward, and I wasn't stuck on a D-lineman. They need a touchdown and a two-point conversion. Anything across the middle. Any check down. Fumble! Oh my god. No. I'm gonna sit on Wilson. Two is mine. Third and 27 from your three yard line. This is incredible. Get there. Fourth and 27. Oh my goodness, boys. I'm gonna bring pressure because I don't want him to have time to sit back there and lob up a ball. <sighs> Give me that. Nice job. Game over. Georgia takes down Miami. We're going to advance to the national championship game. We're either going to get Oregon or Kansas State. So it's going to be a tough game. Cotton Bowl winner. We are one win away from a national championship. Mike Hill Williams, two sacks, five tackles, a forced fumble, the SEC Defense Player of the Week, and the National Defense Player of the Week. Well deserved. Kansas State in the national championship. We're not losing this game. I will never lose to Kansas State. Never, not ever, not ever. National championship. Georgia, Kansas State. Chance at three national championships in four years for Georgia. We got to win this one. Huge chance at a third down here. Give me that! Oh, you gotta go get that. Looks like they're in man, actually. Which means that's gonna be so hard to stop. It's gonna move back inside. Nice job, Trevor Etienne. That was such an easy read. Kansas State can't stop me. Wide open. Right there. Excellent ball, Carson Beck. Let's put the ball on the ground in the hands of Trevor Etienne. Haven't done it yet. Get out of there, 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 get out of there. Give me five, give me seven, give me eight. Nice run, Trevor. That's open. Touchdown. Georgia Bulldogs strike first. Can't let Avery Johnson get comfortable. I'm on mind in here. Damn, I covered that well. I just, I can't cover everybody. Gotta get a stop here, boys. Great job by our defense. Huge. Huge. Please don't go for this. Thank you. Both offenses traded touchdowns, but right now ours is moving. Benyuris Tech touchdown. Easy. The Georgia Bulldogs are rolling the Kansas State Wildcats. I'll be honest, guys. Usually when I play these games, these playoff games are a lot closer. We absolutely crushed Kansas State. 38-17. to The game was not close. We smoked them. And we completed another challenge. The national champions. We won the SEC. We have a winning record versus our rivals. We're actually 6-0 and versus our rivals. That's actually incredible. We didn't have any off-the-field incidents. We made a Heisman final. Our final goal is to have a top-10 recruiting class. We're going to take a look. We're going to see that I complete it. The national champions. Look at that celebration. Let's take a look at this. National signing day. Did we have a top-10 class? If we did, we completed every goal. Wow. 34-man class, 12 five-stars, 24 stars, two three-stars. We absolutely ran away with the number one class. That means I completed all six goals. I don't get you guys' jersey. If you enjoyed this, make sure to comment down below what team you want me to rebuild next. Make sure to like and subscribe if you made it this far. I appreciate everything. And YouTube thinks you're going to like this video. Find out if they're right.